So you're thinking about signing a lease for a place in Bloomington, huh? Here are some things to think about before you sign. What if classes are online and it's harder to hang out with your friends because of pandemic restrictions? Will you have roommates? Do you know whether they've been practicing social distancing? If you do sign a lease and then change your mind, your landlord may not agree to let you out of the lease. And the law does not require them to let you out of it. With fewer students in town, there may be more rental properties to choose from. Regardless, don't let yourself be pressured into signing a lease. If you find a place you like, ask the landlord if they'll agree to a worry-free addendum to the lease, which basically allows you to terminate the lease early under certain pandemic-related conditions. A few landlords are offering this kind of deal for leases signed during the pandemic. Before you sign anything, or if you have more questions about leasing, talk to a student legal services attorney. If you sign the lease agreement and your landlord won't agree to an early lease termination, subleasing may be an option. Review your lease and talk to your landlord. Remember, subleasing does not release you from the lease obligations. It does, however, pass the responsibility to the subtenant to pay rent and other agreed amounts during the sublease term. Will your landlord agree to a buyout of the lease, meaning they agree to terminate the lease in exchange for a lump sum payment? Talk to your landlord. If your landlord agrees to a lease termination, a worry-free lease addendum, or any other deal outside the lease contract, be sure to get it in writing. Remember, a landlord is not permitted to lock a tenant out of a rental unit or shut off utilities, even if rent or utilities haven't been paid. Finally, come to IU Student Legal Services with your lease and other legal questions. Just visit our website to schedule an appointment.